Hi everyone, welcome to the session. In this session, I am continuing pie chart data interpretation. First of all, we need to read the information carefully. After that, we need to solve the questions according to the given information. Here, the information is about percentage wise distribution of employees in various departments. And the first pie chart is given that percentage of employees in different departments of a company and uh, the values are also given total number of employees total number of employees are 4500 whereas coming to the second pie chart second pie chart is about percentage of female employees percentage of female employees in each department uh, in the same company percentage of female employees in each department in the same company Whereas coming to the total number of female employees in the organization, that is uh, 2000. If total number of uh, employees, total number of employees are 4500, total number of female employees are 2000. Obviously, total number of uh, female candidates, which is nothing but total, uh, total male employees is equal to total number of employees minus total number of female employees, which is equal to 2000. That will give you the total number of uh, male employees, uh, 2,500. 2,500 members are male employees. Uh, if you want that particular value, you can use uh, at any point of time. Just I am saying, uh, if you want male values, uh, it is nothing but total minus female, which will give you the male candidates. Uh, and uh, we have several departments, accounts, HR, marketing, customer relation, administrative and design these are the six different uh, uh, six different uh, departments uh, which is provided in this uh, question okay this is a complete information now we need to solve the questions according to the given information here the question is uh, what is the total number of males uh, what is the total number of male employees from design customer relation and also hr department so whenever he is asking about uh, each and every category each and every category whether it is uh, uh, each and every category of male candidates uh, you need to calculate that particular value uh, first one is design design total first you need to calculate total as well as female candidates then only you will get uh, male categories as you want the total number of uh, males, first calculate total number of employees from these three departments. That is design and next uh, customer relation and then HR department. Uh, HR department. So, first I will calculate total value. Total employees from these three, 32 plus 8 plus 22 which is equal to 40 plus 22 62 percentage what is 62 percentage value now for clear understanding purpose every pie chart is 100 percentage 100 percentage is equal to given value as 4500 given value as 4500 here two zeros two zeros cancel therefore one percentage is equal to 45 in first pie chart Whereas coming to the second pie chart, uh, 100 percentage is equal to 2000. Two zeros, two zeros cancel. One percentage is equal to 20. One percentage is equal to 20 for second pie chart. One percentage is equal to 45 for first pie chart. Therefore, in uh, total category of these three, total is equal to 62 percentage. One percentage is 45. 62 into 45 that you need to calculate so first i will calculate uh, separately here i will multiply 62 into 45 four five uh, two five sir 10 one is a carry forward here it is 30 plus 8 38 plus 1 39 3 is the carry forward and next uh, 6 4 sir 24 24 plus 3 27 2 7 9 0 2790 total that is the total number of employees uh, from design customer and uh, hr departments similarly you can calculate female category female persons from hr customer relation and designer so 
females females from these three hr 16 percentage plus customer relation 20 percentage plus design 28 percentage all together all together 28 plus 16 44 44 plus 20 64 percentage and one percentage is equal to 20 therefore 64 percentage 64 into 20 that is 1280 1280 now we got a total number of uh, employees from these three departments that is 2750 and female employees are 1280 from these three so how can you get the male employees it is very easy to get the male employees just by subtracting uh, female employees from the total total 2790 Subtract uh, female employees 1280. Here 0, 9 minus 8, 1, 7 minus 2, 5, 2 minus 1, 1, 1, 5, 1, 0. Number of male employees, number of male employees uh, from design, customer relation, and HR department together. That is 1510. Option B is the right answer for this question. Option B. Next question. What is the ratio of what is the ratio of number of males in HR department to the number of males in accounts department? So here we need to calculate again uh, uh, male candidates. Male candidates in HR as well as uh, accounts department. So first uh, calculate uh, male candidates. Uh, sorry uh, total candidates uh, from hr hr total is equal to one percentage is equal to 45 and here one percentage is equal to 20 that is the standard one eight percentage value eight into 45 that is 360 okay and next uh, similarly we need to calculate accounts also accounts department 12 percentage 12 percentage is equal to 12 into 45 12 into 45 that is 540 and next uh, accounts department in this case uh, females uh, 12 into 20 that is equal to 240 hr 16 percentage 16 into 20 16 into 20 which is equal to 320 right now we need to calculate uh, male hr males hr is to Males accounts department. Males accounts department. Here, males HR is nothing but uh, total HR 360 minus females HR 320. Therefore, males are 40 only. The difference between those two, which will give you males HR. This is 40. Next, coming to the accounts. Accounts total accounts total this is hr and uh, next one is accounts accounts total 540 minus accounts uh, uh, female category that is 240 therefore male category 300 male category 300 540 minus 240 which is equal to 300 0 0 gets cancelled you can cancel with two table 2 2 sir 2 15 sir 2 is to 15 2 is to 15 is the right answer. 2 is to 15. Option C. Next question. What is the respect ratio of number of employees in administrative department? Administrative department. First write uh, 1 percentage is equal to 45. Here 1 percentage is equal to 20. 20 employees. Administrative department 8 percentage. Therefore, 8 percentage is nothing but 8 into 45, which is 360. And next, uh, number of uh, male employees uh, in the same department. Uh, same department in the sense, uh, same administrative. So, first calculate female administrative. 10 percentage, 10 into 20, 200. 10 into 20, 200. Therefore, uh, Total administrative, the question is the ratio of 
total administrative is to male administrative male administrative total administrative 360 is to male administrative how can you get male administrative total administrative minus female administrative which will gives you male administrative male administrative is equal to 160 why because uh, female administrative value 200 and uh, total administrative value 360 so you need to subtract a uh, female administrative from the total you will get male administrative which is 160 0 0 gets cancelled you can cancel with four table four nine sir four four sir nine is to four nine is to four is the right answer nine is to four option a see the next question the total number of females the total number of females are what percent of total number of males in the organization here total number of females 2000 total number of males how can you get total number of males i already told you total number of males is nothing but total employees minus female employees which is equal to 2500 total number of male employees 2500 whereas total number of female employees 2000 now the question what he is asking is female employees are what percent of male employees so the required percentage which is equal to female employees divided by male employees into 100 percentage that is the question he is asking female employees 2000 male employees 2500 into 100 here two zeros two zeros cancel and next 25 four times 20 into 4 which is equal to 80 percentage 20 into 4 80 percentage that is our required percentage it means that female employees are 80 percentage of male employees that is the meaning of that question female employees are 80 percentage of male employees option c is the right answer for this question option c last question in this session the number of uh, female employees in marketing department are approximately what percentage of total employees in the marketing and customer relation together first uh, female employees marketing first i will write uh, one percentage value here one percentage is equal to 45 here one percentage is equal to 20. First one is female marketing. Female marketing 14 percentage. 14 into 20. That is 280. Coming to this case, uh, total employees, total employees means that is belongs to first pie chart. Marketing and customer relation together. Marketing 18 percentage. Customer relation 22 percentage. 22 plus 18 which is equal to 40 percentage here one percentage is equal to 45 then what is 40 percentage 40 into 45 which is equal to 45 4, 45 4 sir 45 4 sir that is uh, 180 180 and one more zero 1800 1800 see the question what he is asking is uh, the female employees from marketing that is 200 marketing female employees marketing female employees what percent of marketing plus customer relation customer relation to get total customer relation total into 100 percentage that is a question he is asking about that is our required percentage but we don't want to calculate uh, exact value we just calculate the approximate value approximate value here the required percentage marketing female employees uh, 280 whereas marketing and customer total employees 1800 into 100 percentage two zeros two zeros cancel and next uh, two nines are 
to 140s. 140 by 9, which is equal to 140 by 9, one time 9, uh, and next still uh, 5 is there. 50 means uh, 5 times, uh, and next uh, again 50. Uh, next that is 5 times again, 15.555, uh, five, 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 and so on. That is our required percentage. Once look at the options, which one is approximately? Here the value is approximately 15 point something. Uh, so approximate answer becomes uh, 16 percentage. 16 percentage. That is our required answer. Option E is the right answer for this question. Option E. Guys, in this way we need to solve the questions related to this pie chart. Uh, so I hope you understand each and every problem. And thank you. Thanks for watching.